everyone welcome back to my channel and if you're new my name is Katrina in this video I'm gonna be showing you guys how I styled my hair into this half up bun with curly hair half down half up bun half down half up half down natural hair style <laughs> if you haven't already I would really appreciate it if you guys could hit the like button subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button so you're always notified whenever I upload so if you want to see how I styled my hair keep watching okay so I just wash my hair in case you guys want to know what i used to wash my hair i use this shea moisture jamaican black castor oil it's like a strengthening and restoring conditioner i bought this maybe last year like over the summer i've been using it but i don't know i'm not too crazy about it i feel like it hasn't really done anything extra for my hair and one thing i don't like about it is i have to use a lot of it when i use it i literally have to use like a whole handful of each whole handful of this just to feel like i really you know got my hair my scalp clean i guess and then like a whole handful of this just to really kind of uh, detangle and go through my hair and i don't like that like you know a conditioner and shampoo is good when a little bit goes a long way or at least that's how i can tell mom when something's really good i mean it's not bad it doesn't strip my hair color it doesn't leave my hair dry so it's, it's not bad in that way i just don't like that you have to use so much of it so i just wash my hair it's still pretty wet so i'm just gonna kind of dab the ends off of that excess water first i'm gonna put a little bit of heat protectant because even though we aren't using that much heat we still are using a little bit normally i feel like people would probably apply product um dry your hair and then kind of style it what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna be actually putting my hair up first and then drying it so we're gonna be doing a half up half down bun so first what i'm gonna do is put it um in a half up ponytail so that's number one i'm gonna take a little bit of this my l styling gel which is my favorite products to use right now when i leave my hair natural so this is mainly for the front so when i put it up it's more tamed. What I like to do is I like to start from above my ear and go up. Okay. Start from above my ear. At this point, you could kind of just take your fingers and run it through. But I want like a really like smooth front, so I'm just gonna take this comb. You can use whatever you like. You can use a brush, whatever kind of brush you like. Oh, you know what? I kind of wanted to leave some hair out. Totally forgot. And I just messed up everything I did, so I have to do it again. <laughs> just want a little bit out. So again, take the hair, section it up, take your finger, section it up, and then I'm just going to take my comb again, and just brush it through. Then after I do that, I kind of go through the ends just to make sure there's no tangles, and then this in a ponytail and that is the start of our bun. Now once that's done you want to start applying product. I'm going to start off again by using the Myel uh, Honey and Ginger Styling Gel. Take about this much. I bring all my hair to the front. If you want you can just do a quick comb through with your fingers just to make sure there's no tangles. After that, you do not want to comb through your hair, brush it. So the next product I'm gonna use is actually my first time ever using it. I saw it in Sally's the other day and I was like, oh, I wanna try this. I'm gonna be using the Myel, what is this? I don't know how to say this. Babasu, <laughs> Babasu Brazilian Curly Cocktail Curl Mousse. I've been loving uh, the Myel products lately. I'm gonna take a little bit of the mousse. Never used this before. It seems like a lot, but it's really not. I just put it through my hair. And I'm gonna start scrunching my hair. The 
what I'm actually gonna do with these pieces is probably gonna have to finger curl these so I'm gonna do that right now while it's still damp Basically, I'm just taking my two fingers and rolling it with the hair. Okay. Yeah, again, like I said, Molly, I feel like what people will do is they will put product, dry their hair, and then do the bun. I don't like to do that just because I feel like once my hair, once once I do the diffuser and once I've kind of styled my hair, like I don't like to touch it. I don't like to manipulate it in any way. So that's why I like to do the ponytail first and then dry it and then do the bun after. I'm going to be taking my Dyson hair dryer with the curl diffuser, which I love. I'm going to dry my hair and then we'll be right back. So here is how it looks and I have to say I really love the way that it looks. I feel like it looks really natural. I feel like it looks defined but not too defined if that makes sense. I just feel like it looks really natural and it feels so lightweight. My hair does not feel greasy or sticky or hard or anything like that. Before the bun I'm going to take a little bit of this Ampro gel which is like basically almost empty but there's still gel on the bottom that I'm like scraping. I'm going to take a little this much. <laughs> I'm just gonna put scrunch that into my hair I just feel like it gives an even more extra hold so now we're gonna do the bun I like to do it while it's dry because your hair gets bigger and it just helps you make a bigger bun I'm gonna just take the ponytail and loosely wrap it around just loosely kind of keep ramping it around and putting the ends underneath at this point if you want you could take another uh, elastic and put it all around but i don't want to mess up the shape so i'm just gonna i'm just kind of bobby pin it in place i was originally thinking to use an elastic but since i got it pretty much perfect <laughs> i'm just gonna take some bobby pins i just like to pin around I don't really do it in front, I pretty much do like the sides and the back where you can't see. Maybe other people can see it, but I can't, so. And you're all done. Again, like I said, I really like the look that like the gel and the mousse gave me. I feel like it looks really natural. Sometimes I like really, really defined curls. Like again, like you saw how I took my bangs. Sometimes I'll go through my hair and do that to each, you know, little section and do that. But a lot of the times I like my hair to look like this because this is kind of how my natural hair looks but frizzy like if I didn't put anything in it like it just looks big and wavy and I really like I don't know I like that look I love that my hair feels so lightweight it doesn't feel greasy crunchy anything like that I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what you think and comment down below what's your favorite product to use if you have curly hair if you haven't already I would really appreciate it if you guys could hit the like button subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button so you're always notified whenever I upload and I'll see you guys next time bye